All right, guys, so I have to apologize. I realized that last week um, the video went a little long and I forgot one important step, and that is how to export your map layout once you've created it. And so just to recap, we created a layout that has a single map layer. This one, oh, this, I don't know what that was. This one here, um, we added a scale bar and a legend and a title to our layout view. So we go to project layouts. We have this layout view, but I didn't show you how you can save that. So that's what we're gonna do real quick. This should be a really short video, just cleaning up what I missed last time. So we're gonna create an exporter. And it is going to be a QGS layout exporter. And we're going to give it the layout we want to export. So now let's say I have a different layout I want to use. What I can do, um, instead of calling this layout item, this layout variable that I've created up here, which is a QGIS or QGS print layout, what I could do here is remember um, I've created this layout manager and with that manager I have a list of all the layouts available. What I could do instead is I could go my layout equals manager dot layout by name and I'd put in my layout name which in our case is just layout one and so that will just return uh, the same thing that I already have here. But just in case you're interested in how you can do this with a different layout that is how. Okay. So now I'm going to create um, a file name to export, and I'm just going to export this to my temp, and uh, we'll call layout export.png. Okay, and now it's super easy to export this. We're just going to do exporter export to image and we're going to give it our file name and then we're going to give it QGS layout exporter image export settings and that should export our image so let's go ahead and click run here no errors let me open up my files Okay, so I got my files open here. Here's my layout export. So let's open that up and see if it looks like it should. And there is my map with uh, the components that I've added to it. All right, I'm going to head back over to QGIS here. And now I'll show you one other way to do this real quick. Let's say you want to say this is a PDF instead. Let's just change our file name to PDF. I'm going to comment out this line of code here and I'm going to add another line here at the bottom. Um, so we'll do exporter dot export to PDF and then we will give it our file name and QGS layout exporter dot PDF export settings. And that should give us a PDF, so let's go ahead and click Run. And then I'll go back to my files, and there's my PDF. Let's go ahead and open that up. And here's my PDF um, of my map. So that gives you two ways to save your map. Once again, I'm sorry that I did not include this in the last video. Um, that would have been the best place to do it. One thing to notice as well, um, is that if I do exporter dot export to, I have other options. So I haven't played around with these very much, but you can you have export to PDFs or export to SVG. Um, just so you're aware of that, those also exist. Like I said, I haven't used these. Um, it's not a feature I use very often just using QGIS, so I haven't had a need to explore how to do it with PyQGIS. Um, but those are also options if that's something you use. 
So as always, if you have questions, please let me know. Um, the code will be made available. Um, and thanks for watching. Um, if you want me to do other tutorials, please leave a comment below, and I will try to get to those. Thanks. Have a great day.